When I became the pastor here five years ago, uh, the church was a little under 150 people. From the first Sunday I began here, we began to see exponential growth every Sunday. Uh, and it was consistent uh, through the years. And now we are over 12 or 1300 strong. One important thing that's helped me is making that time after morning service on Wednesday nights to greet the people, shake hands with the people, even if I'm, if I'm extremely exhausted. You still have to make time to touch the people, to let them know that I'm here to listen to your needs, I'm here for counsel. Um, that seems to help the church know um, that our pastor is relatable, he's touchable. Uh, creating fellowship times for new members. I know once a quarter we have a, a fellowship time where all the new members come out, they meet me, they meet the church administration. Um, I believe that's really important to let people know that you're not a number, you're not an envelope number, you're not just another person on the pew, but you really do mean something to us. This congregation is made up of uh, all the way from babies up to 90 years old. I mean, there, there's that big, that big gap. Uh, every generation exists. Uh, every generational demographic exists in this church. You're gonna have a church full of loving people, people that love God, people that love each other. Uh, a, a church full of praisers, a, a church that's not afraid to let go, let God do what He wants to do. You see a loving church. That's one thing this church has always been, a loving, warm church, where it's big in number now, but you still get that, that you know, very close, family-centered church. One thing I can say that is totally different here at New Haven Baptist Church is um, the spontaneity of the Spirit. Our worship experience is something that is life-changing. We often tell people, if you love your church, you may not want to visit this one because it will, it'll draw you in. What makes New Haven unique from any church in the world, I'm willing to go on record to say, is the fact that there's a genuineness here. That there really is a genuine love, a genuine move of the Spirit, which we don't see too much in this day and time. It's not fabricated, it doesn't have to be pushed, it doesn't have to be manufactured, it's real. So at any amount of time in our service, you'll see miracles, people will be delivered in the service. Uh, the prophetic anointing will fall on me and, and we'll begin to speak into people's lives. That's what makes New Haven unlike any church you'll see anywhere. I often tell them no matter where you go, uptown or downtown, you'll never find a church and a ministry like this one. And, and that's because the hand of God it is really resting and abiding amongst us. Some of our prominent ministries would be our youth and young adult ministry that caters to the vast amount of children. We have so many children in this church. Uh, so there's a youth department that's even now still revamping and progressing to meet the needs of an ever-changing church. Um, I would put that as the pinnacle, uh, our youth, our young adults, the church of today, not tomorrow. Outreach uh, is a major part of our church. We are a missionary Baptist church, so missionary work is uh, one of the very most important facets of my vision and administration, getting outside of here, going outside of the church, and then internally giving more than just spiritual things, but becoming all things to all men that we may save some. There's never a ceiling in God, and so we always want to go higher, uh, go deeper, and ultimately become what we need to be to not just minister to Indianapolis and Indiana, but prayerfully bring the gospel to the entire world that, that Christ is, is real and He's soon to come. And New Haven has that warm christ Center feeling to make you feel at home if you haven't been in church in years. When you come in here, it feels like you've always been there and you could possibly find a place right here, you and your entire family, uh, to be able to experience God for real and go from where you are to where he wants to take you. If you avail yourself and, and really let him, you can do that right here at New Haven where the word is preached without compromise, where the spirit of God dwells and where we just wrap arms around you and we love you where you are. And, and we pray that God takes you the rest of the way. And I guarantee you a precious and sublime experience each time you attend a worship service here at New Haven. That's, that's a guarantee and, and the history speaks for itself.